Hello and welcome back. Today we're going to be doing hopefully quite a bit um, and going over this. I've decided to try and aim for the 15 minute mark on these videos just as a general uh, time limit and uh, we'll see if that's any effective for trying to keep the content relevant. So we're going to speak to the lighthouse keeper, the mayor and the builder apparently because they've all got things to say to us in some respect. <sighs> what is it the light Housekeeper asks, pretty disdainfully, I might say. Do you have any shipwrecks around here? She eyes you suspiciously. Mm. There's a spot near the back of Greater Mario where the current carries in the wreckage from the sea. Some nights you can see a unnatural glow rising from that patch of dark water. I can't imagine what's down there in the deep. So if you're looking for what I think you're looking for, it's best you just move on. Well then. Or any heard of any? Oh, I mean, that's what the glow is then. Have you heard of any strange things happening? I see plenty of strange things from atop the lighthouse. Sometimes I don't know whether I or not I can trust my own eyes. She holds the lantern up so, so that it shines brightly onto your face. Mm. Are you really just standing up here in front of me, or is it just another of the fox tricks? Oh, who lives on Blackstone mm. Isle? I see a lot up from here, you know. I saw that ill-fated boat return, and I chose to look the other way. I watched a natural glow flicker through those windows. Whatever you've got planned, I hope you know what you're doing out there. Well then, um, don't know what I'm doing, so yeah. Uh, let's go with the flow of the water, because it's, it's a water game. Yeah. <laughs> what can I do for you? to ask about the wider region. Certainly, is there somewhere in particular you wish to know more about? Sure, let's talk about the Devil's Spire. Sounds interesting and a little scary. Active volcano amongst a city of ancient ruins. I must caution against sing there, however, the ruins lie low in water and will surely tear through your hull. Not to mention the aforementioned volcano could erupt at any moment. You can occasionally hear it rumbling from here. I imagine that's how the, uh, the mayor would sound. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? Twisted Strand. Mm. I don't think there's much to tell. It's just a tangled mass of trees. Often blanketed in thick fog even during the day. You want some good light, a good sense of direction if you go exploring there. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? Yes, mm. Stella Basin. Popular tourist destination. There's a resort on the atoll built on top of a beautiful coral reef. Sounds very pleasant. I'm sure there's a wide variety of fish there. Maybe you fancy getting your hooks into some of those. Maybe I do. Uh, oh. Gale Cliffs. The main port over there is a place called Ingfell. It's right on the approach to the cliffs. You can't miss it. It's a whaling town, but I haven't heard much talk of it these days. I think quite a few people have left one way or another. Is there another area you'd like to discuss? Mm. Blackstone Isle. It technically falls under the jurisdiction of Little Marrow. I believe it was sold to a private owner some 20 years ago. They must have had a special arrangement such as a sale. It's quite uncommon. Very complicated paperwork involved, you see. I've not met the owner. I suspect they don't live around here. The island seems quite uninhabited. Um, I think that's it, yeah. We've we gone for them all. Do you know of any shipwrecks? Fortunately, there have been quite a few in recent years. The lighthouse helps, but even struggles to cut through the fog some nights. We do our best to salvage and clear any shipwrecks that occur around this side of the island. That should make fishing a bit easier for you. Yeah. Around the back, though, it's a little harder to get to. There are still some wrecks and deeper patches you should... You want to avoid that area. I don't know if I do. That might be interesting thing. Yeah. Strange occurrences, let's ask. Well, I heard that my counterpart in Little Marrow met the most unfortunate end. Well, did he now? They say he went quite mad suddenly. One day he was normal, and the next he was pacing the shoreline, hurling people's belongings into the sea. After some days like this, he disappeared, never to be seen again. Nowadays, the tale of the old mare is used to scare children. Not many remember him, myself included, and those that do remember don't seem to like talking about it, a most unpleasant subject. 
What happened to the last fisherman? It's a good question. We are in that profession now. <laughs> the last fisherman? Oh, he was very unreliable. He'd go out at night, come back with no fish, proceed to sleep all day. Terrible captain. I mean, really terrible. Constantly running aground on the reef, even in broad daylight. The shipwright almost ran out of wood for repairs. Oh no. No, he was no good. One evening he left and never came back. So long, he shan't be missed by us. What else? We should get back to some fishing. Well, that's a lot of expose and narration, but oh, now we've got to talk to the builder. Well, one last one. Woman well, sitting by the dockside, staring out to sea, and she turns to you. Mm. What is it like out there? I I'd say it's peaceful. It's got to be a damn sight better than this bloody town, I think. I just need to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you? You should always keep moving forward, keep moving along. Ooh, I don't think I can go back. So if you find any materials, can you help me move? I mean really move. There's an island I heard about, Steel Point, just to the north. Two units of lumber and two units of scrap is all I need. I can place myself there. You'll be welcome to visit too. Just stack it up at steel point when you have anything, and I'll pay you when the job's done. Yeah, we we certainly can do. I think the scrap is the uh, the thing that we're lacking. We don't have a, a whole lot of uh, dosh, but uh, yeah. All right, let's actually get out there now. Oh, so much faster. I'm going to try and get around. Could have cut through a little bit better, but let's get around the back of here. See if we can find anything in particular. Is this a dredging spot? No, it's more of an eel spot. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll do. Keep him. There was quite a bit of. Ooh! <laughs> I've done the same thing again. There was quite a bit of, um. Dredge somewhere or other. There was. Hmm. Wreck. Okay. Get the cabin for bonuses. 5% more movement speed than listed. Oh, that's good. I guess we'll start reading that one. Oh, it's a red sparky one. Ah, oh, but I don't think we can do this, can we? Oh, can we? Oh, we can. Oh, God, I forgot. I'm so terrible at this. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Oh, God, I'm so bad. God. I think the game just took pity on me. Oh my god, there we go. Relic. Key. Okay. I am absolutely foul at that mini game. Wow. Um, I hear it's just. I think, yeah, I think the game took pity on me after a while. I don't want any more eels. Do some squids, but yeah. Some more dredging. Trophy caught. Goodness me. That's a very cool eel. Just getting a bit late. Oh, there's a dredging opportunity there. The thing is, if I go over. You know what? Let's, do, let's continue. Let's continue. Sigling, come on, coming out. I guess you can always rest here too. He went to the collector's house. He's standing at the back of the room, still holding the silver and crimson book. He seems impatient. <gasps> you have something, don't you? Show me. You hand him the key. The cold metal shimmers, a strange shine as he holds it. The shape of the key, the teeth, the head, 
now somehow seems changed smaller. Has it always been this way? Is this all? Where's the lock? He grows agitated. It seems the piece we're looking for have traveled further than I anticipated, much further I suspect. In that case, allow me to aid your travels. He turns a few pages in a book and mutters something low under his breath. A burst of light fills your vision and you stagger back. Well, the man's casting spells on us, clearly. Ability unlocked haste. Overworldly speed at a price. Tells me that current may have carried some debris southeast towards Gale Cliffs. May that your priority? Okay. Well, yeah, I need to know what you, what you, what you do to me. The book holds power from the deep. I merely extended its powers towards you. Is there one in particular you wish to know more about? Yes, the one you just did. The words of haste are instant and cruel. They will impart a terrible speed to your vessel. Be warned, however, it may put a great deal of stress on your engines. Hmm. Are there other powers you wish to know? Oh. Hmm. hmm. I used to be a fisherman, as my father was before, but two decades ago I took up residence here. I needed to focus on other endeavours. I found this island has a certain strength to it. Those dark basalt columns stretching downwards into the deep. Do you know who owned these relics? Yes. Well, that's a very straightforward answer. He looks at you for a moment. A look of something like regret flashes in his eyes. Hmm. An old friend. Probably the previous fisherman. I would say. My intuition tells me that the current may have carried some debris to the southeast. Yep. Not on the map. Okay, well, that's good. Um. Clearly, we've got. Got a new fish. Steel point is marked. Gale cliffs is down there, which means it's on the other side. Definitely probably gonna have to use haste to get there, I think. Alright, we're gonna play a bit risky. We're gonna go back out and see if we can get that dredging material. Oh my god, it's already. Oh my god. Oh my god, something's wrong. Something was roaring and, and like rumbling me. It was out there. I don't know what it was, but like I could feel it on my controller. Well, it wasn't pleasant. That's fine. Oh, there's a ship over there. It's back. Interesting. Okay, we've got to go do some nighttime exploring. Oh, some interesting stuff happening. I thought I'd tell you. The lighthouse keeper emerges from the dark forest that flanks the town. She walks towards the dock with a confused look on her face. Mm. Oh, it's you. Who were you expecting? Your engine. It sounds like. I'm sorry. I mistook it for the vessel of an old friend. Dejected, she turns and walks back towards the lighthouse. Huh. Um, do I? I don't think I do. Well, this is a special fish. Okay, well, I sold all the fish then, special or not. I still don't have what I need. I wish I could. If I can, I can buy scrap. I've got two improved engines, which is correct. Do I have any traumas? Hmm. I don't have any more space for an engine, I don't think. Weighted line. Okay, so what have I got again? A weighted line, and I've got a simple skimmer. 
yeah, I definitely think I need more. Alright, well, I think that's all for this episode. I will be continuing in the next one where we are going to go and find out what is going on. And maybe we can get some building materials for that builder to move away to a new place. Thank you very much for watching and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.